Cleanup crews are going to be back out in Atomas Park this morning after thousands of gallons of diesel spilled into a pond there. Sacra Gray is live at Tanzanite Park with how it happened and also how long the cleanup's expected to take. Good morning. Yeah, good morning. You're absolutely right. Crews out here have a big job on their hands here at Tanzanite Park. If you take a look behind me, it says the park is closed until further notice. They've got the caution tape wrapped all around the park, making sure neighbors and their pets are protected, making sure that they avoid this area. And that's the pond back there where thousands of gallons of diesel spilled into that pond and workers are going to be out here cleaning up that mess. Now, fish and wildlife officials tell CBS 13 that a fuel tank for a generator leaked at a company about a mile away and that fuel spilled into a storm drain leading into the pond. Neighbors are disappointed they can't go to the park, but more worried about the wildlife that was impacted. It's kind of sad. You know, we, we like to see everybody live in harmony, especially the animals, you know, and they don't have a choice about what's going on. And um, I know if my kids heard about this, they'll be real sad. Wildlife experts rescued five birds now being treated at a care center in Fairfield. We won't know if the company responsible could face fines or possible charges for several months. Now, the cleanup continues at 730 this morning and every morning until this mess is cleaned up. They say they'll be here until dark every day to make sure that the situation here is contained, hopefully sooner rather than later.